It's like Genius of Love with lyrics about dying and reuniting with a loved one in heaven. The video was shot at Rye Playland in New York, the vintage Art Deco amusement park where the Tom Hanks movie Big was filmed. Carrie, who rollerblades and rides a roller coaster in the fantasy video, is also joined in it by, of all people, Wu-Tan Clan rapper Old Dirty Bastard, who raps on a hip-hop remix of the song. The fantasy single is due out September 12th. A future single, One Sweet Day, features Carrie with Boys to Men. In more music video news, rapper Tupac Shakur is serving one and a half to four and a half years in an upstate New York prison for a sex abuse conviction. So when it came time this week to shoot Temptation, the next video for his album, Me Against the World, he wasn't exactly available. That's why a bunch of his famous friends gathered in Los Angeles to lip sync Tupac's lines in the video. Here's what some of them had to say. I'm here because uh, they asked me to come and it was, you know, for, it was for, uh, for a homie, you know what I'm saying, he's uh, not here right now, he can't represent himself, so since so I'm from the West Coast, you know what I'm saying, I can represent and uh, hit him up for Tupac, you know what I'm saying. We're here for Temptation, Tupac's video, and we're right. here because he's a friend of ours. He we was love in, him? Yeah, we love him, we support him, and he was in our video, too, yeah. if you didn't know. He what was in the bed with me. <laughs> he's always been there. And for me, whenever I needed him, so it's only right. In return, I'm going to be there whatever he needs. They pass this little book around us for Tupac, my heart. I hope he keeps his head up, like he tells me all the time. Um, it's a little book where we're just writing little things to him to make him feel good, just in case he's feeling down, but that's about it. Tupac's label, Interscope Records, remained at the center of controversy this week as gangster rap foe C. Dolores Tucker, who chairs the National Political Congress of Black Women, fired back at Interscope and at Death Row Records, Dr. Dre and Snoop Doggy Dogg's label, which Interscope distributes. Last week, Interscope and Death Row sued Tucker for allegedly trying to start her own clean rap label by meddling in their relationship with Time Warner, which, under fire from the likes of Tucker, is trying to sell its half-ownership of Interscope. On Wednesday, Tucker branded their lawsuit spurious, and she has yet to comment on the latest issue of Vibe magazine, which reveals that she was fired as Pennsylvania's Commonwealth Secretary in 1977 by Governor Milton Schaap for using state employees to write speeches for which she was paid over $65,000, and that she and her husband were found to owe $25,000 in unpaid real estate taxes in 1973.